Hello everybody, this is Michelle Fox and welcome back to Quick Tip Friday. Today I'm going to be talking about how you can find fabrics that are out of print or out of stock. Now my number one go-to place is Etsy. I have found lots of fabrics that I couldn't find in other shops on Etsy. For example, one year I was short on a fabric line called Aspen Frost. I just needed a little bit more and I found it at Etsy. It was the only place I could find it. So um, if you have a fabric that you're having difficulties finding and it's out of print, check Etsy. Again, it's been my number one go-to um, place to find outdated fabrics, or not outdated, out of stock or out of print fabrics. Now, another place I have found some older fabrics that I couldn't find at, um, you know, my most fav favorite uh, online quilt shops or my local quilt shops, and that's been Hancock's of Paducah. And I watch that site pretty frequently because they um, will put fabrics on clearance there and I can get some older lines uh, pretty inexpensively and um, like I said they'll have they'll have sometimes they'll have um, some backgrounds for example uh, Minnick and Simpson just recently had a line that I couldn't find elsewhere and I went online at Hancock's of Paducah. I got there just in time to get enough backing that was on sale, enough fabric for backing and it was on sale and it was one of the coordinating fabrics to the fabric line that I was looking for. Another place you can go is fabric.com. Now I have used fabric.com before and uh, that was when I was looking for fabric for my cottage quilt. Uh, or my spool cottage quilt. You all have seen that one before, but uh, I did go online and I found that. Another place that I find fabrics is I just simply Google it. If I know the name of the fabric, the manufacturer, the designer, I'll Google it and then it will list shops that have had that fabric and I'll just simply start calling the shops. That's if I'm really, really wanting to find a fabric that I can't find out elsewhere, I will check that out. You can call your local quilt shops or go visit your local quilt shops. And sometimes maybe one of their employees bought some. If you just need a little bit, maybe they'll be willing to sell it for you. You can check your quilt friends. I've done that before. You can check your, you can check with your quilt friends. You can ask your, um, the members of your quilt guild. That's a good source. You know, just take a sample to your quilt guild meeting and say, hey, does anybody have this fabric and they might have enough for you to finish your project. Now this is not a source that I've ever tried before but it's certainly a possibility and that's um, checking your Facebook and Instagram groups. Now there you can reach a lot of people and who knows somebody might have just the fabric you're looking for and might be willing to um, sell it to you and give it up. There are two, um, there are a couple of search engines specifically for quilt fabrics, and I have used um, those before. Um, one is called fabshophop.com, and the other one is called quiltshops.com. So you can check those out and see if um, either, you can find fabrics on either of those. And on those, you can just enter the designer, the fabric, name, the, the line name, or the SKU number, and uh, thousands of shops participate in those um, search engines, so that might be an, uh, a, a resource for you. And for my last tip on how you can find that, find old fabrics, is you can actually email the designer. Now there are a lot of designers out there who have websites and you can simply email them to see if they're willing to see if they have any of the fabric. And then also Moda's website has all their designers listed on there. And again, they all have websites you can check out. Or you can even contact Moda and they can give you a list of uh, places that sell their fabric lines. Now Moda isn't the only um, quilt 
fabric company that lists their designers, Henry Glass, um, Timeless Treasures, uh, Riley Blake, they have their designers listed too and oftentimes they will have websites for their designers so you could check out lots of different designers to see if they have fabrics. If you have any tips to help us find quilt uh, fabric that is out of stock or out of print, please list it in the comments below. If you've had luck with any of the methods or tips that I've given, please uh, mention those in the comments below. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. If you have, please hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't, share with a friend, and as always, leave a comment. I love to get the comments and I try to reply to each and every one. So until next time, have fun quilting.